Now that school is back in session, your students may be having a tough time adjusting to the new schedules and specifically when it comes to using the bathroom. Well, parents, we've heard your complaints about your children not being allowed to use the restroom when they need to and concerns about whether it can actually harm them. Our Brittany Dion on your side live tonight with what a local doctor and mother says you need to do to advocate for your child while they're at school. Brittany. Yeah, that's right, Catherine. Jonathan, the doctor we spoke to says there's a fine line between training children and making them hold it too long. Trustful family medicine physician Dr. Creed Johnson understands parental worry about kids not being allowed to use the restroom at school on their personal schedule. She herself has had to speak to her daughter Zoe's teachers about it. Say, hey. You know, if she has to go, you may need to kind of let her go because she's not anatomically made like everyone else. Zoe was born with one kidney. Dr. Cree says she feels at ease because she communicates with her daughter's teachers every school year and has never had a problem. But for parents who do have concerns and are reaching out to WBRC for help, we ask Dr. Cree if a student holding their bladder can be harmful. She says it can. Because we don't want to one um, have any urinary tract infections, and we don't want to weaken our bladder. Dr. Cree says holding urine can cause incontinence later in life. We want to make sure that we're thinking to urinate every two, three, you know, maybe four hours. It's called bladder training. Dr. Cree says children should learn it, and schools should have set schedules to teach it. Use the bathroom right after breakfast. Can we use the bathroom right after lunch? Can we use the bathroom at break? Can we use the bathroom? With her? You know, so we'll we start to say where are the natural breaks. She says this helps eliminate disruptions in the classroom and that parents should make sure their students go during set times. The more that everyone is brought in on the conversation, the better. Now, Dr. Cree says your best bet is to talk to your child's school if they have some sort of health issue. And if they don't, she says just make sure they go when they are scheduled to use the restroom at school. And it's better for everyone in that case. Live tonight, I'm Brittany Dion, WBRC, Fox 6 News on your side.